quite coming on to the bat, but such is the form of the cock. He's just stroked that one down the ground for four. That is a remarkable shot. Over the top, opening the blade. Free flowing, good work from Hendricks. Really good shot, that. Really good shot. That is beautifully hit straight down the ground, and that has gone for a big six. Terrific stuff from Reza Hendricks. And he still took him on, and to really good effect, Reza Hendricks. Very confident. 12 off it. Let's add four more. Really good work. Terrific fast feet. Bowled him. It's found the gap. Bit of a gap there. And it's gone straight through and the celebrations begin. Might just have slid on through button pad. So playing down the wrong line, Reza Hendricks. And look at the elation, the celebration from the Jamaican. He certainly enjoyed that one. Scoop that away. Nice and fine. One bounce and that's gone for four. That's a very clever shot. Oh, he's hammered that. He's hit that beautifully. That's gone all the way for six. That is an outstanding shot. The cock is putting on a show. So he just made an initial movement across to the offside and got the length as well. And a massive blow from Quinton de Kock. Oh. Gets this one through. And it will feel good for Bavuma. His uh, first boundary in his innings. <laughs> Got him again. As we said, the matchup has worked. Pollard and the West Indies, along with Andre Russell, strike. Driven and gone. Little risk and great reward. A boundary for Van der Dusen. Innovation being shown. He's not afraid uh, to play that ram shot, and he does it quite well. Oh. Uh, he should put that away, and he has. It's a good way to end that over after a few good balls from Dwayne Bravo. 95 for two. Oh, this has gone straight up. Uh, doesn't have the distance. And an easy catch on the boundary. It took a little while to get to Evan Lewis, but he's managed to take it. And it's a big wicket. Just a slightly slower delivery from Fabian Allen. Not really a powerful strike of the ball. Real slower ball. And again, this time around, straight towards the fielder and take it. Hold it into the attack and gets a big wicket. Another short delivery, slower ball into the surface. Didn't have enough pace on it to beat that fielder. And such a, an exceptional catcher, Fabian Allen. Drop that in short. Didn't get all of it, but got enough. That's an important boundary. Oh, he's hammered that. That's nicely struck. That was a lovely sound off the bat. And what a great way for him to sign off that over. Six to finish, 17 gone, 133 for four. Pollard, by the way, is at long off. Just where that ball's going. And he's got him. Straight to him, it was flat. I don't think that went above six feet off the ground, actually. That was so well hit, but straight to Pollard. He creamed it. It was just uh, the placement that he didn't have. It was there for the taking. He went straight. Could have gone a little bit wider, but all credit to, to Karen Pollard. Slice that in the air. Covers. And well caught. Two and two. 
Sinclair the catcher and Bravo, well there's surprises in the game yet again. Just in the middle it peeled off the outside edge of the bat and smart catch in the end by Kevin Sinclair. Not to be so close from Dwayne Bravo. But he sits on a famous number. 519. That's the number of wickets he's taken in T20 cricket. Squeezed away, found a gap, might have picked up a boundary, has picked up a boundary. South Africa needed that desperately. Nicely worked on the onside for six. That's a great start to the last over. 50 up for Rassi van der Dusen. Continues his fine form in this format of the game. Three balls left in the innings. The right man is on strike for South Africa. McCoy is continuing his fine work. Oh, that's a pretty good crack on the bounce line. Oh, no, it's gone for four. Unforced error. Fletcher down there. Not very spicy from Andre Fletcher. There is protection. So it is Pollard. There's a good arm as well. Direct hit from that distance is pretty good work from the captain. Wanting Puran to take it in front of the stump section so there's no deflection. But that's 20 overs. 160 they end up with. 160 for six. They just want to do a double check. Middling total, you would say. Haven't had a lot of T20 international cricket at this venue. No issue there for Kageso Rabada. We'll uh, get a red dot to his name and we will get confirmation that uh, he is not out. Dispatched. Too short, too straight, a flat six. He's on the way, first delivery. Makes the connection. And this time, Evan Lewis got the length and it got the treatment. Another boundary for Lewis. Edge the way. Gets it fine. Gets the boundary. Another boundary. Consecutive boundaries for Evan Lewis. The West Indies are off. Takes him on and gets the distance, Evan Lewis. Another boundary. Two sixes, two fours for the pugnacious opening batsman. Just living up to his standards, Evan Lewis. With that strike rate of 169 against the short balls. Well, he's gone after it as well. Forget about supporting. I want to get in on the act, says the spice man. Just slow a ball from Manrik Nukia. Welcome, says Evan Lewis. Just plants that front foot down the wicket and clobbers it past the bowler. Another boundary. Helps it out along the way. Another wayward delivery from Ngidi. And just needed to get some bat on it. And that he did. Consecutive boundaries to start for Evan Lewis in this over. Another short one. And another six. Such a powerful strike of the ball. Takes on that short ball, even with the fielder in the deep. Just playing to his strengths, Evan Lewis. Stand and deliver. Such a dangerous batsman. And another one goes again. Two fielders in the deep this time. Doesn't matter. Sails over their heads. Ends the over with another six. Consecutive sixes to end. Expensive. 20 runs coming from it. Brings up the 50 in only the fourth over. 52 without loss to the West Indies. Rabada. Another boundary this time. Is it? Yes, it is. Just enough on it Andrew Fletcher two sixes for him exquisite
it from Fletcher. Doesn't move after he plays the shot. Just stands there because he knows it's racing across the boundary. The homeboy, the spice man. Power again and finding the gap. This is superb from the West Indies. What a start. Denier, but it's well over the top. And his field is tearing after it, but it's going to skip away to another boundary. No answers at the moment by South Africa. But Fletcher and Lewis are on a fantastic run. Down the ground. What a magnificent shot. Straight for the commentary box and a 50 for Evan Lewis. He's played like a man possessed. We followed him. He followed him. He's really got to get a move on, though. He's really got to get a move on. And Gidi throwing down the stumps from fine leg at the non striker's end. TV umpire to director. We have a run out at the bowler's end. And I have the best side on angle. Keep rolling. Keep rolling. Ricket's broken and the bat is short of its ground. Welcome to the crease. I think that's what Chris Gale said. Welcome to the crease, Reza. There is a reason why he's never bowled in T20s, clearly. Mike? But what a welcome. Now that's short. And it's also been smacked for six more. Just too short. Chris Gale just gets under this one and nicely pulls it away. Power. He might be fancying another one, is he? It's coming towards us. Yep, that's six more. Just doing what he has done so far. Get back into his crease and hit power, strength. Slightly short, tried to hammer outside the playing arena and has been hammered outside. Six more. Just keeping with the flow of the game, Evan Lewis. Six runs. Shamsi is not going to get away. That's all he's saying in his mind. He's not going to get away. Yes! To brace Shamsi, screaming after this one. It's gone very high indeed. And it's a very good catch. He's got very safe hands, David Miller. That's what they wanted. The end of Evan Lewis. You're not getting enough on this one, Evan Lewis. And a comfortable catch in the end. Rabada now. Oh, crack! First ball. What a sound off the bat. That is magnificent stuff. My goodness. Short delivery. Hammered. 90 meters distance from Andrew Russell. Just shows the power and strength of this man. 31 from 42. That's what's needed. Slightly short. Has that been hammered for six? Yep. That's another one. Gee, it's been raining sixes today. Just sitting back, Chris Gale, and pulling this one into that area where the wind is blowing across the ground as a left-hander. So a little help as well. Oh, George Linder's got to make sure he's out the way of those. You wouldn't want that coming straight back at you. Slightly leg side, that's whipped away for another boundary. See, these boundaries are simply coming at will. Suddenly, that's 16 runs and that over. 14 gone, 146 for two. Oh, that sounded good. Good enough for a massive six onto the second tier. 150 on the board and in the 15th over. Pitched up delivery. It was smashed. 
by Andre Russell, who just stood there and going even further than the 90 meter six that he hit earlier. 95 meters. Again, that is massive, and what a way to finish and go one more up in this five match series. Six, number 15. West Indies win comprehensively. This has been superb by the home side. And they should be very happy and celebrate this win. What a way to make a statement in this five-match series.